hello viewers in this video i am going to show you how to register the gateway in the things network after signing into things network uh, it will take you to this page here you can find the home and console options and we need to click on the console option so that it will take us to the console page and in console page you can find the two options available over here one is applications and the second one is the gateways as we are registering the gateway we need to click on the gateways and here we can see the three previously registered gateways in order to create the or in order to register the new gateway we need to click on the link available on the right side that is the register gateway and after clicking on the register gateway it will take us to this page and here first thing what we should do is creating the gateway UI and in order to create the gateway UI we need to select this I am using the legacy packet forwarder and if we click this this gateway ID will get changed to gateway UI and the gateway UI means uh, extended unique identifier it is uh, exactly the 8 byte address and uh, hexadecimal one and uh, as it is a 8 byte address we need to type the total 16 hexadecimal characters I will type BB C C B B then G G 1 1 2 2 3 3 then the 4 4 and I hope this ID is available and it has become the blue color and the second thing what we should do is the description and suitable description we can type over here I'll type the info byte and the next is uh, selecting the frequency plan uh, depending on uh, which part of the world you are residing, uh, you can select the frequency plan. I am going to select the India and the router will get selected by its own. So, and I will show you if I change this to the Australia, so it is a meshed router, and if I change this to the India, it is a TTN router Asia SE. So the frequency plan and router so suitably we should select depending on which part of the world we are residing and then the next is the location location it is not the mandatory so if you wish you can select the location I am going to select the location here this is the location and the last thing is that is the antenna placement and here two options are available indoor and outdoor depending on whether the gateway you are placing the indoor or outdoor we can select the antenna placement so I am going to select the indoor and then last thing what we should do is uh, clicking on this registered gateway and here you can find notification successfully registered and uh, successfully we have registered the gateway and uh, going back to the gateways here in the last we can find the registered gateway and in order to overview this gateway we can click on the gateway and we can overview the gateway and if you want to delete this gateway you can go to the settings and just scroll down here uh, at the bottom you can find the delete gateway UI hope you like the video please subscribe to our channel thank you